I'm going to show you how to beat the clock. Let me explain what that means. You have 15 to 30 seconds to wow them, to knock them out, to capture their attention, and make them want to listen to the rest of your song. You have to beat the clock. And piles of CDs just like this are given to me and others who are in the recording industry every time we go to a major event. And songwriters come from all over the world in hopes of having their songs recorded and placed on a major artist. And some of these people are singer-songwriters who have hopes of launching their careers with their songs. These CDs represent their dreams, efforts, many hours of time, money, their blood, sweat, and tears. And thousands come to these events, and with them come thousands of CDs and thousands of songs. And a stack of CDs like this was given to me at one event, which was a four-day event. Now, each CD has about 10 songs. And think about it. Can you imagine how many hours it would take to listen to all of these songs in their entirety? We sincerely want to listen to every one of their songs because we all started off the same way. We all had to beat the clock. We all had to capture and hold their attention for 15 to 30 seconds. It had to sound like a hit. As I mentioned, we love to listen to all those songs, but there's just not enough time in the day to listen to all of them. When publishers, producers, and artists are looking for a hit song and have hundreds of songs to listen to, here's what happened. First, they put the CD on and the clock starts ticking. If it doesn't sound like a hit within the first 15 to 30 seconds, they move on to the next song. Well, it's like when you're listening to the radio. If you hear a song that you really don't like, what do you do? You change the station. Well, you're just like everybody else. The key is you want to listen to something that you like. You have to put the best part of the song within the first 15 to 30 seconds. Hook us immediately. Remember when you watched American Idol? Those auditions where you see thousands of people out in the stadiums and they're in the heat, they're in the cold, they're in the rain, and then finally they make their way up to the front of the line and then in front of the judges, they're given the 15 to 30 seconds like anybody else to really wow them, to make them want to hear more. And if they really sound good, they go past the 15, they go past the 30. They go all the way to when they really want to stop singing. The moment they open their mouths and the way they sang would determine how long they'd be standing in front of the judges. And unfortunately, most of them only last 15 seconds before they were asked to stop because they only had a few spots which were reserved for the very best and many didn't last long enough to beat the clock. But if they don't get it, if they don't sound great within the first 15 seconds, they say, okay, thank you so much. Have a good day. And they move on to the next person. So it's vitally important that you recognize that that golden time is the first 15 to 30 seconds of your song. Taking this course and applying these techniques will help you beat the odds and beat the clock.